the liver contains hepatocytes the amino acids that enter liver acts as precursors for the synthesis of liver proteins the liver constantly renews its own proteins these proteins have a relatively high turnover rate the average half life of these proteins is of hours to days most plasma proteins are synthesized in the hepatocyte and are transported to the extracellular space some amino acids pass into the blood stream then these amino acids in the blood are transported to other organs in other organs these amino acids are used in the synthesis of tissue proteins other amino acids synthesize nucleotides hormones and porphyrins in the hepatocyte amino acids not needed as biosynthetic precursors are transaminated or deaminated and degraded to form pyruvate with the release of an ammonia molecule the pyruvate is then converted to acetyl coenzyme a the acetyl coenzyme a then oxidized via citric acid cycle the electrons released from citric acid cycle go through an electron transport chain and finally are accepted by oxygen molecule to produce water this electron transport chain is coupled to another reaction in which adp and pi combine to form atp so the whole process starting from transfer of electrons from the substrates of citric acid cycle and ending with atp formation is called as oxidative phosphorylation the ammonia released from the metabolism of amino acids go through urea cycle to produce excretory product urea pyruvate goes through gluconeogenesis to produce glucose and this glucose can be converted into glycogen and are transported to the muscle where they get stored acetyl coenzyme a can be converted to fatty acids these fatty acids then can be converted into lipids for storage the citric acid cycle intermediates goes through gluconeogenesis to produce glucose this glucose can be converted into glycogen during the prolonged interval between the meals some muscle proteins are degraded to amino acids these amino acids in the muscle go through transamination to produce alanine this alanine is then transported to the liver and deaminated to form pyruvate with the release of ammonia please subscribe like and share